The perfect judge. The judgment of God is according to truth. Romans 2 verse 2. God is the only one in the universe who is perfectly qualified to judge. We can be everlastingly thankful that he has not entrusted the final judgment to us. Think of some of the disabilities under which an earthly judge works. It is impossible for him to be completely objective. He may be influenced by the prominence of the defendant or by his appearance. He may be influenced by bribes or by other more subtle considerations. He cannot always know if a witness is lying. Or if not lying, the witness may be withholding the truth. Or again, he may be shading the truth. Or finally, he may be sincere but inaccurate. The judge cannot always know the motives of those with whom he deals and it is important to establish motives in many legal cases. Even the polygraph or lie detector can be fooled. Hardened criminals can sometimes control their physiological reactions to guilt. But God is the perfect judge. He has absolute knowledge of all acts, thoughts and motives. He can judge the secrets of men's hearts. He knows all the truth, nothing can be withheld from him. He is not a respecter of persons but treats each one impartially. He knows the mental ability with which each one is endowed, an imbecile may not be as responsible as others for his actions. He knows the differing moral strengths of his subjects, some may resist temptation more easily than others. He knows the differing privileges and opportunities each one has, and the extent to which a person sins against light. He detects sins of omission as easily as sins of commission, secret sins as easily as public scandal. Therefore we need not fear that the heathen who has never heard the gospel will be treated unjustly, or that those who have suffered wrongfully through life will be unavenged, or that wicked tyrants who have escaped in this life will go unpunished. The judge on the bench is a perfect judge, and his justice will be according to truth and therefore absolutely perfect.